Mud. Hey, what's going on, everybody? So we went fishing. It was the full moon and the day after the full moon. And I was like, you know, some fish might be in the water today. So I went fishing. So let's go check it out. See what happened. Brr -ba. Forgot about how slick the mud gets here when it's uh, when it's wet. Well, that's the reason this soil, whatever, whatever is different about it is the reason that uh, the grass here grows so well, you know? I think we don't want to spend too much time in this area because it's flat, it's grassy, it's not rocky, gravelly or sandy. Sort of looking for those gravelly or sandy sort of areas because that's where the fish would want to in the future spawn and right now it's pre-spawn so they're up in areas nearby not quite in the sandy area yet but nearby are moving towards that sort of uh that sort of dealio just for sheeshes and why the heck nots let's try and cast this uh four ounce lure Here we are, once again, at the dam. Start with the crankbait. See a little bug on top of the water. Oh. Oh, that fish almost just ate it right there. I just watched a bass try and eat my crankbait and miss it. Okay, there are bass out here. That bass totally saw me too. The moon is either full or almost full. I got a fish. It's a good one too. Woo! Good three pounder. <laughs> I don't know how well the uh, GoPro picked it up, but yes, sir. Nice chunky, chunky guy right here. Full moon. All right, y'all. We're casting in the dark, and we got this guy right here. Nice, cool little three pounder. We're going to get him back. Get Buddy back in the water. There he goes. All right, no skunk. <laughs> Even though it was too dark for the GoPro to see anything. Still got a picture, got the fish. We'll be back. Uh, I just saw, was that a bird? Or was that a fish? Or was it a birdfish? <laughs> it's a big fish, dude. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Got my lure back. Oh yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Alright, little bird. We we get it. We we get it, dude. Can you show me how to do it one more time? Yeah. Alright, sorry. It's all good. Loop de loop like that, and it goes over the main line and the hoop. You want to go through the hole. There you go, and cut little tag ends off. Please don't be the powerboat guy. It's too early for power boats, man. Give it a boop, give it a bop. Yesterday was the full moon, so you'd think, you know, with full moon, rising temps. A lot of sunlight. Some of these fish on the full moon would have pushed up to start making their beds. So that's the hope today. Are your pants waterproof? Uh, no. Oh, okay. Why? 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 
Why? <laughs> oh, uh, there's a spot that we could get to, but we have to walk through a creek. <laughs> Why did that take you so long? Hell yeah. Uvas Reservoir. Hopefully, it's not ass. It's the highest I've seen the water. Because normally, you see where the water goes behind the reeds over there? Normally, I walk that way. Oh, really? Yeah. Hell yeah. <clears throat> Did you land in the reeds? Yeah. Nice. Hell yeah, dude. It is quite muddy here today. Probably want to use a bright color. Yep. It's actually a pretty good one for this uh for this pond. Oh my God, <laughs> it's one of the bigger ones in here. It's like a one pounder. <laughs> like I said, there's fish in here to be caught. Just not uh not typically any monsters, but this guy is doing pretty good for himself in here. Heck yeah. I give you a kiss. Get you back in there. There he goes. Hell yeah. No skunk. Yeah, most of the fish that I've caught here in the past, it, if you can cast right next to the reeds without like getting stuck in them, that's usually where they are. Got one. Yeah. Yep. Not very big, but it's a fish. We'll take fish over no fish. <clears throat> fishy, fishy. Way out there in the grass, probably chasing some shad, listening to some uh, chill music, throwing a easy little lure. Let's get him back. Oh, wrong way, buddy. Go that way. There you go. Yeah, way out there. It's like as close to the little creek channel as I could get, I think, is where he bit. There's a creek channel underneath the water in the like, not quite dead center, but like a little more towards the other bank. Close, close to center, but closer to the other side. So maybe just as long a cast as you can physically get. Maybe the key here today. It's five o'clock, been fishing since 9 a.m. Caught two fish so far. Pretty sweet, dude. Pretty sweet. You know, it should turn on any day now. I don't know. It's just, it hasn't happened yet, but it's going to happen soon. 
So the only way to catch it is to be out here and ready for it. I got another one. Yeah. yeah. Nope. It's long, skinny, long and skinny. Mr. Skinny Penis. Whoa, don't get a hook in me there, Jim Bob. I put a hook in myself. You don't need to put a hook in me. All right, y'all, so we've been fishing since nine. This is fish number two. It's probably right around two pounds, but second fish for the day. Or actually third fish for the day. But hey, you know what? We fish for full eight hours, get three fish. Uh, that's a, it's like a limit in, I don't know, the south or somewhere, dude. I know there's three fish limits somewhere, but we're gonna get, Mr. Skinny Penis back in the water and uh, hopefully keep catching some fish, dude. Go that way. There you go. Goodbye. Have a good life. If I added the combined total weight of the fish I caught today, it'd probably be about uh, like four pounds <laughs> between three fish. Let's see. We've This is our fourth spot today. It's definitely been a grind. It's definitely been a grind. The vid in the video, in the video, it's gonna look like it was like 12, 15 minutes. But just know that this 15-minute video, full, full, full-time, eight-hour day. Something like that. Yeah, it's pretty sick. Not every day is perfect, but it's That's called fishing and not catching. Yo, smoke ass, eat grass. <laughs>